Hey guys, Brita here. Welcome back to Big Ambitions. Here we are for episode number three. Let's head outside and wait for so Uncle's call. A call from the bank? They must be shocked to see what's happening with your account. <laughs> the way it's growing. You should find yourself a nicer apartment and buy yourself some really nice furniture. You deserve it. Thanks, Uncle. Where's our bloody car again? Over here. At the front of our Beast Burger. So there's our feeling thorny flowers and gifts. And here we have... Beast burgers, we've got burgers, fries, hot dogs, and ice cream. Let's head on in. So everything should be set up, ready to go. Uh, I don't know about the... I don't know if I need to hire another cleaner, because it seems to be dirty every morning. Or I need to split their hours or something. Not 100% sure, but we've got the speaker down here. We've got one, two, three, four places to spit. I did spit to sit, even. Um, I've got the garbage bins there with the speaker there, and I've got a couple of speakers on the wall. Hopefully that's going to improve things here. Um, yeah, we're still only 35% happiness. We need to get our happiness up a little bit more. But let's jump in our car and head down to Bike of Bohag. We'll get this uh, next little thing completed. The next shop I'm thinking of doing, I'd like to do a hairdresser, because I haven't done a hairdresser before, but um, I don't know... Uh, 10 o'clock. God damn it. I don't know how that's going to go. Um, getting a hairdresser shop and that sort of thing. Let's look at uh, the Market Insider. Uh, anything that's not zero, no provide. Anything that people aren't providing is uh, a provider of everything except for lawyers here, um, which we may need to do, but I think. Uh, um, it's going to be hair, chemical fee, 66%. So there's only one business with cutting fee, products, shampooing, styling. So there's only one other business in the area that does um, that. So let's have a look at uh, the Google Maps. You look for a hairdresser. Where is the hairdresser? Show me that there's heaps. Uh, retail. Actually, let's go... Garment District. Actually, no, that there's only one, which is just here, which is Eddie's Natural Carts, um, owned by Millennium Investments. Open in Bizman, uh, 5.5 million. I don't know if Eddie... Obviously, we don't have... Um, the speed, speed should be going flat out. We haven't got rivals available yet, so I'm thinking uh, once rivals come... The businesses may change a little bit. The save game will continue over. I have definitely confirmed that um, with the developer from Hofgard Games. So um, I've spoken to Jonas and just confirmed that um, everything's going to continue over from this 0 0.4 to 0 0.5 build. Um, I didn't ask you about the experimental branch, if that would carry over from experimental 0 0.5 to the full release 0 0.5 I mean there's potential that it wouldn't so that's why I've decided not to uh, to do that so all right let's go in here let's throw in our time again I don't think it really matters eventually I'd like to leave it as normal but uh, grab a trolley we'll go straight through this way to where the computers are which should be over in here we want to just grab the cheapest possible uh, the cheapest possible desk which is probably this one standard desk $900 computer uh, gaming chair yeah we'll grab the black game actually let's go let's grab that table it's a gaming PC Let's just get the normal computer. It's way cheaper. We'll grab a desk plant. Uh, let's grab a rug. Why not? Anything else we need for home? Like a treadmill would be good. I don't know how expensive. Actually, a TV would be good as well. Don't know if I can watch the TV. Let's let's grab a TV. And let's see if we can grab a cheap little couch. It's a module. That's seventeen hundred. That's eight hundred. Yeah, let's just grab those. That way we can put in a lounge, a computer, a TV, and that sort of stuff at home. Just so we've got the ability to increase our um, our happiness while playing games, watching TV. I have 
spoke to these guys. Yep, I have Ikebo Hag, they can do deliveries, which is good. Some drinks, fridges there, we don't need those. Will this all fit? It will. Right, jump in there, we'll go back and get this put inside. I'm gonna have to run around to um uh, feeling thorny and grab a trolley. And make it a lot better for us to be able to get things in. There's beast burgers, feeling thorny. Two shops are going pretty good. Can't complain at all. Where the hell are we gonna park? Right here, excuse me. It's illegal because we're on the curb. Oop, bang bang. Oop, pinball. Right, let's run down. We'll grab a. No, oh, bugger. Let's grab a scooter. Yep. 20 bucks, but I'll get there quicker. Me too. Oh, I was going to press spacebar to do a jump. We can't do jumps. Park vehicle. Come inside the feeling thorny. Hopefully things are going well in here. Let's grab a hand truck. This won't be returned. Luckily we've got infinite hand trucks, which is good. Who owns this bloody thing? Park it down in 3rd Street. This is the cheap area of town. Have one of those things down here is not a great idea. Alright, manage storage. Let's go. Desk, computer, desk plant. That'll do. Now, where are we going to put this? Oh, so we're going to put it all in here. Right, let's put it there. Uh, place. I can't see a bloody thing. Put it in the middle. Gaming chair can go there. Desk plant can go there. Come outside, we'll grab the rest of the stuff. We'll put that in there as well. That could be like a little... A little gaming slash office room, I suppose. Uh, let's turn around. Um, look, sofa. In there. Which little sofa left. TV, hopefully. Um, yeah, we won't, don't want to put it up too high. We'll go carpet. Beautiful. Let's go and play games for... Uh, one. Boost 25% happiness for 7 hours, which is good. Let's skip time. Watch TV for an hour. I hope you're having fun, huh? That's what it's all about. And well, let's get back to your business again. Because... Didn't even see what that one was then. lot to learn, kiddo. Things are going great. Oh, yeah. But... There are a lot of potential customers out there who never heard about your stores. So it's time to start marketing. Yep, 100%. Let's go and do some marketing. So go to McCain's e-marketing. I sort of want to spend a day um, off camera just visiting all the businesses in the city um, that we can use. So the other bank, the marketing place, um, the IRS. Um, I'd like to get a nightclub set up too, but I believe they're quite expensive um do we even have nightclubs uh, do, do, do. yeah we do have nightclubs good canes is just there so let's park over here all right come straight inside yep can we enter thank you let's talk to this guy Alright, select business, Beast Burgers, we'll go small internet campaign, 100 bucks. And we'll go new campaign, feeling thorny, small. Beautiful. Hey, make sure you keep the popularity very We're skipping high. through a lot of stuff here. You gotta come see my new villa in Marbella. We'll drink some sangrias together someday. It's amazing. Anyways, I'm glad to see you figured out how to increase your profit. Our next move is all about cutting out the middleman, the wholesaler. We gotta start importing our products ourselves. Right, yeah, so we can do that. Open a headquarters in your new office building. I don't know if I want to go a small headquarters or a big headquarters. Um, we look at the map. How many do we have? I think there's one. Import, export. So, one, 
two, three, and I think it's four import exports. So we need enough room for at least four desks and that sort of thing. What street am I in? Third street, this is our street. Um, we want to go down to the import exports actually and talk to all those guys as well. Let's look at the maps again. Um, an office. So an office is actually not too bad there. Is that going to fit four people in it though? Um, can I preview the... That should fit four people. Purely for our import export business. I think that's all we need. Uh, start a new business. We want to go for headquarters. Um, what are we going to call our headquarters? I've got no idea. Like a, a proper business name. Obviously, our name is my name in game. But what's our business name going to be? Oh, I've got no idea. Uh, let's just call it Britain Enterprises. Britain Enterprises. That'll do. Start business. Done. Right. Congratulations on your new headquarters. This is where the top employees of your organization will be seated. But first, we have to start hiring. We need a purchasing agent to help us secure some import contracts. Alright, let's head down this way. I think there should be Jet Cargo. Actually, this is the only one, I believe. Closing at 4 o'clock. I know we're illegally parked. We won't be here long. Put the doors all the way around the side. Okay, come and talk to... Ah. We don't own a warehouse yet, dumbass. Alright, face plant. Um, that's not going to help, is it? I'm going to need at least four purchasing agents, I believe, long term. But um, if we get them done straight away, like, oh, there we go. I didn't think I could get out up this end. If we can hire four of them straight away, I know it's going to be a bit of dead money early on, but it'll certainly help us later on. So let's head on up. Um, to the city workforce and we need to hire, hire buy computer desk and a chair so that's going to be tomorrow I believe um, we're not going to get there today I don't think or nor have the money today to be able to buy the stuff we need right let's turn right here I don't know if um, we can change the advertisements like our logo and stuff for Britain Enterprises, do a custom logo. We probably could, I would assume, but truck. This it here. That's the office supply shop. What I'll do is I'll run in here. Uh, where's the door? The graphic designer. Oh, it's all the way around the front. Oh dear. I'll just run in and talk to the delivery person. That maybe help you. So then we can go Britain Enterprises. So tomorrow, the computer's 900 bucks. I really can't afford it. What else do they have in here? Waiting chairs, meeting tables, coffee machines, water coolers. Uh, what's that? Computer, graphic, tablet with screen, laptops. Yeah, cool. Right, this is what we need. City workforce, we'll come in here. Talk to you. So we're going to need um, Britain Enterprises, a purchasing agent. Okay, so a logistics manager, purchasing agent buys all the stock. Logistics manager will get the stuff from the warehouse to our businesses, I believe. HR manager, they individually take care of our employees. So they'll... Um, not train our employees, but every day they'll get a certain percentage of their skill improvement um, over time. And then anybody that um, calls in sick, potentially they'll replace with a labor hire person. Um, headhunter, I'm assuming they will just find the staff we need. All right, so we want um, 
want at least four candidates, but let's go ten over not ten days. We've got two and a half grand. I only really need four. Let's go five. Five over two days. That'll do. Right, so we'll just make sure we get the best people we can. Um, looking at the map, is there anything else? Uh, da, 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 anything else that we need to look at? Client store, where's the bank? Where's the nearest big bank? That's the office. Where's our... Um, uh, Jensen Capital, where's our other big bank? Up here. Bantanda Bank, we'll set that as our destination. Go and have a chat with them. We may be able to get um, get another decent loan. We want to at least pay off our Jensen Capital loan if we can and then maybe get a bit of extra funds just in our bank. That wouldn't be too bad. Right, let's go. I definitely want to buy a van as well. So, oops, sorry. We need to go and... Uh, check on the US truck place. We're going the wrong way around and about. Happens in real life. I can do what I want. Um, yeah, check on the US trucks and see exactly what they have available. If we can get one of those big post op vans, like these things, that would be epic. Otherwise, our, our van's going to be our next purchase just to be able to get more stock moving around quicker. I um, also want to have a run through there's three different companies we can get to fit out our stores straight away now I think the cost of that is excruciating um, can be quite bloody high so I'm hoping that um, the developer does what he needs to do and changes that a little bit uh, let's go Kind of view. What do we got? We've got uh, 40k with you. Can I get a new loan of say 100,000? They can help with that. That's good. All right. Well, let's go. Uh, pay that off. Pay that off. Make that uh, 500 a day. That way you can get it paid off a little bit quicker. We've got 62,000 in the bank, so we can actually get some stuff organised. Let's look at Mr. Scott's office supplies. Get a delivery for Britain Enterprises for tomorrow. Um, actually, I don't know what people are going to want. They're going to want some extra stuff, aren't they? I don't know if we give them a laptop. A four of you, and then they're, they're going to nah. They're going to want all different desks. We're going to have to wait till we um work out. Who we're gonna um, hire? Let's oh shit! Let's go down here. Uh, where's our U.S. trucks? Car dealership trucks. Let's set the destination down to there. We'll go down and have a look at the um, what we can buy as far as trucks go. Because I want to get rid of this mimic. And if we can get a van, that's going to help us immensely to be able to just get things get things in so the purchasing agents and stuff I said we need at least four of those guys they're going to want certain things um, they may want a water cooler they may want a coffee machine they may want a certain chair they may want a certain desk so that's something that we're going to have to look at when we go to hire each employee oh, oh Jesus um, I think it'll be around the right hand side isn't it? yeah it's around this side so we'll go and swing in there and have a look see what they've got I don't think they've got any New, new vehicles, from what I believe. I don't think I've seen any updates on vehicles or anything. Let's head on over. Uh, so got van, 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 and trucks and more vans. Okay, so it's pretty much a van or a truck. Like the truck is ninety-eight thousand. The van's like twenty. Eight, 8,000, that's bloody cheap. Um, but you'll see, it should give us 
14 cargo capacity, so it's six extra than what we had before. Uh, tank capacity, yeah, let's let's purchase this thing. Beautiful. New van has arrived. Alright, let's come over here and jump in this and go sell. Yep, thanks uncle, we don't need it anymore. Go around and grab our van. I think we'll just go home and go to sleep then because there's nothing else that we can really do um, at the moment. Hey, where's all my fuel? They didn't even fill it up. Oh, damn assholes. Oh, shit, this thing does not turn. <laughs> oh, it does not turn as good as the Mimic. Right, what's, we're in Third Street. That's good. Our business should be right here. Can we get a park right out the front? We can. That's good. Let's swing in over here. Definitely want to keep an eye on um, our Beast Burgers. They're saying they're low on stock, but there should be like tons of stuff out in here they need to get, and I actually know what I need to do. I need to grab... Um, I want to grab at least three more storage shelves for over there. So if we come over here and to AJ Peterson's... I want to grab at least three more shelves in there. Not those ones, these ones. Uh, bakery, croissant. Do we want to get another speaker? I don't know if we do need another speaker. Disco balls. Grab a wall product sign to see what that does. Security is pretty good. I think we're still at 100%, so it's really not an issue. Right, and then we'll get through the day. So as I said, like the game does get quite slow at times, especially when we're doing this sort of stuff. So if you guys want me to cut things out, skip things, let me know. If you want to see a 100% of everything, let me know as well. Um, it's going to be completely up to you guys. I don't want you guys to get bored and be like, you know, you're doing the same shit over and over and over again. But it is quite repetitive until we get to later stages. Uh, let's put this like up here. Now we can go like that and go... Burgers! Probably need a few more of these. That, if you could custom make them, that would be even better. Alright, so we've got enough room for... It looks like we've got enough room for people. Can I come over here and go, excuse me, I want to work. I don't know if it's going to auto do its thing. Oh, there we go. I don't know about the cleaner. We might need to add um, some extra hours for the cleaner if we can. Let's go. Um, you want full time, haven't you? You've got 42 hours. So what I should do is maybe go there and there. Do that every day. So drop it back three hours. Drop it back to three hours. And that way he can... Um, clean before and after. But then we probably need someone... Also work full time in the middle. Like we probably need another cleaner, I would think. So we've got a cleaner all hours. Um, I know... Um, other games, like definitely not fried chicken, which is completely different to this, 100%. Um, if you have a cleaner all hours, you get a, an extra bonus perk. Um, you get more customers in, which I think would be pretty cool for this as well. Alright, three, like that. Let's go contacts, let's go innocent recruitment, call. Can we go camp? No, okay, never mind. Sorry, hung up on them. Uh, let's go Beast Burgers and we'll go cleaning full time. I don't want two people over the next two days because we'll get one at each, I think, feeling thorny and also in there. Uh, should I look at uh, the interior is 70%. That's pretty good for now. I want to bump that up a little bit, but I'm not going to stress too much. All right, let's go watch TV. How many hours can you do it for? Five hours. Let's go four hours. Alright, it's not too bad. Let's do this for 
few more hours. Uh, cheap flowers are nearly out, that's good. Alright, so I want to look at... Actually, let's look at it now, Beast Burgers. Um, so we've sold a ton of stuff. That's what I'm really concerned about, that we're selling 909. I don't even know uh, how many days we've we done. So last seven days we've done one, two, three, four. Over, over four days we've sold this much. Uh, let's go delivery Friday. Need some hot dogs, some french fries. We're going to need burgers as well. Let's go. Three hot dogs, three french fries, three of you. How are we going for paper bags? We'll go one paper bag. We'll get that delivered tomorrow just, just to be safe. Uh, I want to get up at, say, 6 a.m. Right, four, three, five, seven. Total profit, which is pretty good. Feeling thorny nearly runs out of stuff as well. That's only getting delivered Monday though, which uh, we've sold uh, 144. So this is sort of we need to look at um, the last seven days. It's dipped off quite a bit there. Look at that. But it's Our marketing's gone up as well. Um, from 68 down to 18. So we've been open for 18 days at the moment. Still getting 40. 40 to 60 customers, but we need to keep an eye on this. So we're going to need some cheap and expensive flowers. So we're going to have to pick them up ourselves, I think. Um, what time are you open? You're open at 8. Yeah, okay. So let's go back to bed. Let's go till 7.38. Uh, fresh food. Go down and grab our van. We'll grab some cheap and expensive flowers, we'll run them into the store. We're gonna wait for our purchasing agents to come through. Right, hopefully we'll get... Oh, Jesus. So we can't buy that, which is a bit of a bum. I reckon that would be an awesome little truck to be able to buy. I believe we can use vans as delivery vehicles as well for our warehouses, not have to actually use these big trucks, but these big trucks obviously have more capacity so they can get more deliveries done um, each day, which is good. This car is very slow, the van's slow, which is awesome. Turning's not great, but still down here way too early. Oh, Jesus. Brakes are terrible too. Right, let's get the speed going again. Get some music pumping. Right, let's go. We want some expensive... Uh, over here, aren't they, I think? Oh, Jesus. Yep, cheap and expensive flowers. Right, park vehicle. Grab four of each. And then I need to go through and set the proper delivery every Monday. Once we get our warehouses and stuff, it's going to be way easier, way different. Right, done. Place order. Thank you. Let's go. We'll go and get this dropped off. So this is something that you want to try and... The reason why you want to get your warehouse is so you're not backwards and forwards, picking up stock here and there and uh, doing crazy things like this. We can let our game speed uh, flow for now. Let it keep going. At um, full speed. I just wish there was a way we could skip time without having to sleep in our vehicles. Because um, it gives you a negative impact. So if there was a way just purely to just, I don't know, let's just press wait. Wait in vehicle or something would be way better. Alright, manage storage. Grab two of each. Throw that straight on the shelf. But hopefully they should auto restock all that. Manage storage. In. Dump it on the shelf. They're good. Put our hand truck back. Now we just gotta wait for some calls. So we might as well go home and um oh, there's an employee come through. Purchasing agent. They just want full time. 
which is fine. We go, how do we get, oh, here we go. We're in headquarters, schedule. We just work, I don't know if we just work. We can't change the hours, okay. Need to get um some stuff in there for them. So we need to get all of our employees in before I organize our delivery. So what I could probably do towards the end of the day is um, uh, 15 hours left, nine hours left. Let's do some computer games. Um, once we get all purchasing agents, we'll write down what we need for them. Um, and then we'll go from there. Uh, cleaning. Beast Burgers, okay, go down to you. Got Beast Burger, we'll go Beast Burgers, schedule. You can fit smack bang in the middle there, which that's gonna increase our um, our costs, fortunately, but that's gonna be better. And that's gonna be too many hours for this dude, isn't it? Uh, it is, okay, so. Take a couple off on a Monday. Same on Sunday. And Saturday, so we can have a couple of lazy days. So that's done. That's done perfect. Alright, let's keep skipping through time. We'll wait for some more employees. It's getting happier and happier. Come on now, where's the rest of them? we go, another one. Cleaning, uh, you can go to feeling thorny. Done, we'll go into here, uh, schedule. Joe Maguire and then Jeff. Actually, yeah, we can't do that. I was gonna say, it's annoying that we, I still wanna be able to, um, we can change this for every day. Friday should be there. Let's move that back. I think we wanted them all like that, didn't we? I think we we're getting more customers later than we were earlier. That could be another reason why our customers are dropping quite a bit. Um, I'd like to be able to go, you know, select Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, and then change the roster for that day for those five days in one instead of just doing schedule for all days because if we schedule for all days now our saturday sunday removes gaylord and dick will get put in there so there's some great names especially saying them together right so they should be all good cleaner all hours let's keep skipping we still need Three more um, employees. Comes another one. But they just want full time. I want to select you and you. Train skill. Okay, we'll get rid of you unassigned. Skill. So they should be both training. Yeah, that's fine. All right, watch TV. Five hours. That's going to be okay. No alerts. Uh, hope we're still. Uh, where are we? Two candidates. It's not you, it's City Workforce. Five candidates over two days, so we still haven't got anything yet. Um, out of expensive gifts. We have more. Uh, no, we're low on expensive gifts as well. Bloody hell. We're going through things like crazy at the moment. Um, still open down here. Not till 8 a.m. So we'll sleep through till 7. It's 5,070. That's probably our best day so far. Feeling thorny is still a bit of an issue. Um, let's look at Beast Burgers. Stock. Okay, deliveries are going to set that for Monday. 
That'll be good. Where's our, our van's down here still in it? So we're gonna run down and grab some um, expensive gifts and we need to try and get this so we're not having to do this every couple of days. Even if I have to order more than what we really need over over the full week, it's not going to matter too much. So as I said, it, it does does drag out quite a bit um, doing all this running around the episodes. I said I think I want to get 35 minute episodes, but I'm thinking they're going to be more between f Jesus 45 minutes far out 45 minutes. Um, to an hour long episodes I think um, and I know most of you guys will be like yeah that's cool so they should be over here shouldn't they yeah expensive gifts arc up let's quickly double check okay, grab oh, my hands are already full trying to put it in there let's grab one of each uh, two of those one of those need to not look at what's in stock and just look at what we've been selling over the week so tomorrow I'll make sure we go through both businesses our deliveries are going to be on Monday so I'll go through both businesses and try and make sure we've got close to this exact amount or even one more box than what we're actually selling but I also think our I call them ten to two. Yep, I don't know if they're even open tomorrow. I have to manually go and get all that myself. Um, tomorrow, if they're even open tomorrow, or if they're not open, then Monday will be the day. All right, let's grab all these, throw these in. Bang. Happy as Larry, hand truck can go back. The floors should stay 100% clean now, which is really good. Alright, so what I'll do is I'll skip through till we can get this um, HQ up and running and I'll bring you guys back when we can um, get it all sorted so we don't have an episode that goes for too long. Righto guys, we're back. So we've got all four employees done. They've all done a little bit of training. We need to hire, um, order some supplies for tomorrow, but Geraldo has sent me a message saying he now wants a water cooler. Good on you. All right, we'll get that sorted for him though. Let's go, Britain Enterprises, tomorrow at 10 a.m. Um, I don't know what sort of tables they're gonna want in the future, but we'll just grab four. Grab four phones. Uh, normal office chair, I guess. Actually, do we want to go? Uh, yeah, office chairs. So table, office phone. We need a water cooler. What I want for laptops. Uh, we'll grab two of you. Two of you. I want to go. A Cheap coffee machine. Where do we put the coffee machine? I want to. I thought it went on a cabinet, but maybe. Uh, maybe it doesn't. Paper bin times four. Small cabinet. Guess we can see if it goes on there. I think that's pretty much all we need. We don't need any waiting room chairs. All right, let's order that. 10 a.m. tomorrow. Look at our Econa view. Yesterday we um, uh, doesn't think it tells. It's like 4,000. Actually, day 20 was 6,606. So we actually made a decent amount of money. Five nine yesterday. Today we only made three and a half. We did have um, heap of deliveries. Yep, fourteen thousand, seven thousand, so twenty-one thousand dollars worth of deliveries also um, turn up. So now we should have full shelf, nearly a full shelf in there, which is good. Coming through over to Beast Burgers, which I don't know if it's even open yet. 
Uh, tan. It's open in an hour. We need to fix the walls and floors in here. We should have yeah, decent amount of storage in there. So let's quickly look at the floors. I don't know if that's um. Sure, if what that actually, if that is actually um, carpet or something else, I don't know. Um, change the change the colours of these guys. I want to do like a red. There's a beast burgers, obviously. Grab that to there. So this can be sort of where people line up. We probably need some barriers down. Does that look silly? Maybe it does. Maybe we do it like that. I know, that's that's six thousand dollars already. I also want to do the walls, red and yellow, which I don't think that's going to be that great. Don't know what to go with here for the walls. I think maybe simple. Just go red all the way along that back wall, or is that that might be too much? White all the way down. Like more of a grey, I guess. Not that you can really see it. We can apply that and see how we go. That looks a little bit better. Still not great, but hopefully no one will be complaining about um the store when they walk in. No one is, which is good. So we could probably put some barriers down here. I need another one of these to come out to here. Maybe separate these guys a little bit. Now let's go do an order. I want a burger and fries, please. I can actually get all this stuff for free, which is really cool. Thank you. Um... Nice working with you. Let's go back home. I don't know if I can stick this in the fridge, actually. We're quite, quite full, so I may even just chuck it on the ground when we get inside. But we'll skip through till 10 a.m. tomorrow. We'll go on. I put it in the fridge. Yeah, we can. Good. Uh, these guys aren't assigned. That's fine. Let's skip through till. Let's go like 9 a.m. Gives me bit of time to get to the business. How'd we go with profit? Four and a half thousand. So we're still averaging between four and six. Isn't too bad. Uh, no real issues there. Now we need to actually look at where is our office? Uh, just there. Yep, just there. Okay. It's right next door, pretty well. Um, we have, yeah, we do have access to the trolley. I want to put this over there out of the way. We'll grab a trolley. I'm outside. We might as well park it here and then just be like, let's play computer games till... Uh, what do we need? 50 minutes? 47 minutes will do. Which means we'll be able to go out, get through the door. That delivery should turn up at 10 a.m. Boom, there we go. Manage storage, let's go with the four office desks in straight away. So we sort of want the main, main desks out the back here. Like this, and then we can have... Uh, do we want one out the front? I don't think we need one out the front. We could probably set that up as like a, a little waiting. Actually, we might have one office out the front. Just there. They can be like our executive, I suppose. Right, done. Back inside. Office phone. I don't know if these make a difference, but I'm assuming that someone will eventually ask for it. Don't want that there. There, thank you. Grab that. Uh, four chairs. I don't know if that needs to be moved further forward, that table. Put one, there we go. 
Right, manage all laptops. Manage go other laptop. There. Oh. Gotta get the camera in the right spot, otherwise it doesn't like where you're trying to put things. Right, done there. Let's go open in Bijman. Purchasing agents. Actually, back into here. Bang, bang, bang. All to go. Sign business. Uh, written enterprises confirm. Sign uniform. They should all be office staff uniform. Yep, cool. All right, let's go back over to here. Uh, schedule all days. All on there, ready to go. Ah, progress. Your first operational employee working from your brand new headquarters. Starting to sound pretty fancy, huh? Now, we need to get your purchasing agent working. But first, we need a place to store all your imported products. Right, so we need a warehouse. We're probably going to get um, a couple of warehouses, to be honest. Because um, I want to sort of franchise all of our things, so... Yeah, I can just go on the ground for now. Um, yeah, I want to franchise a few things to have um, each of our one of each of our gift stores um, in each uh, district. I want to have one each of our um, it's a bloody tiny cabinet. One each go on top. No, I can't. Bloody hell. One each of our gift stores, one each of our burger shops as well, in each each suburb, each district. Paper bin to move these guys. That can go middle there. That can go. Yeah, I don't know if that makes a difference, but right, if we go Bismarck, purchasing agent, actually schedule. Yeah, nice to have. So they're all critical. That's f good. No contracts. We're going to have to go down, rent a small ha warehouse, buy at least one pallet shelf, place pallet shelf in your warehouse. So we need to do all that. But I think we're going to... So we're going to try and rent multiple um, warehouses. We're going to want one for each of our businesses. And I think even going a small warehouse isn't really worthwhile yet but we'll probably do a small warehouse purely just for our um, gifts and flowers shop and then get a bigger warehouse for our fast food because obviously our fast food place is gonna it's gonna need a lot more storage our french fries and burger it's cold but who cares right so that's those guys done so I'll need to run down as well and get the purchasing agent set up so I'll do that now off camera I'll bring you guys back next episode. We'll go through and we'll get a small warehouse and a large warehouse. We'll get those guys fitted out. And we'll just keep progressing through the story here with um, Uncle Fred. And uh, we'll go from there. But hopefully you guys did enjoy this episode. If you did, as always, smash that like button. If you guys are new to the channel and haven't subscribed yet, guys, please do so. It's been Brito. Thanks for watching. We'll see you again soon. Hey guys, Brutto here. Welcome back to Big Ambitions. Here we are for another episode, episode number two. We're going to continue on where we left off. Um, our uncle's going to give us a quick call. Hell, look at you, hustling around and stacking cash already. I tell you, your dad would have been so proud. I think it's time for your first hire. And don't forget to take that course at the Business Administration School so you know what you're doing, all right? All right, uncle. Okay, so we've got our first business name here, a uh, feeling thorny. Flowers and Gifts custom logo that I did actually do. You can actually see the custom logo here as well. And here, this logo, you can't really see it. I'll actually be cut off down the bottom, but I've got the actual address on that logo. So the address of um, the, where the business actually is. So we'll head off to the um, school where we need to go and do our course. So we can get a... Get some employees working for us, and we're going to have to do another course after that to um, be able to expand and uh, open another business. We just smacked into the fire hydrant, I think. Uh, what time's it open? 
6 o'clock, so we're pretty close. Let me go option, let's get the time going. Right, done. That should get us in even quicker, so complete the course, get some employees, wait for the agency to respond, hire a customer service employee, and then sign an employee. So what we're going to need to do is get um, basic management learn, let's do the whole thing. Um, skip that, we're going to have to get a full timer and a part timer so that we can open seven days a week um, and then hopefully we can get a cleaner as well. Let's drop this back down to that. Alright, um, head back out. We need to go to Anderson Recruitment which is actually tomorrow. So what I'm going to do is spin around, um, grab some more food. From here, uh, have something to eat and we'll go and open the store for a little while, I suppose. We're probably not going to open for very long today. Uh, what's the time? Four o'clock, so maybe we could open till eight, which I think is when we normally open till anyway. So let's jump in here. Let's spin around. Oh, Jesus. That didn't happen. Uh, spin around, we'll head down. It will open up for the rest of the day, and then tomorrow, first thing, we can head down to Anderson Recruitment and hopefully get some employees. Right, so we'll go, opens at 8 o'clock tomorrow, let's go open in Bijman, schedule open. Uh, should be open. Start working, yeah, we've only got like an hour and a bit to go, but we'll skip the time. Better than nothing, let's grab our cleaning. Jesus, that's a lot of mess for very little t bit of time open. All right, get that done, and then down here as well. Done, let's go home. So tomorrow we're gonna have to go to Anderson Recruitment, which, uh, where are you, what time do you open at? Eight, so we might have to delay opening tomorrow. Till, let's go till 9 and then once we get down there and open we'll change um, change the time obviously so I've got our next shop's going to be like a burger shop so I've got the name already organised for that um, I've got Beast Burgers so logo's already done good to go but um, any other ideas that you guys have got for names let me know um, I'm recording this same day as I recorded the last episode, so that's purely why I've already organised a name for the next uh, the next business. Uh, let's jump in our car, head on down. We can get out here. We'll have to try and squeeze our way out. Go, you idiot! Not gonna work. Taxi's coming. I'll swing this way, head down to Anderson Recruitment. They'll be open at 8, so they're not far away from opening now. He went through a red light, didn't he? Maybe it just turned green. I don't know. Alright, let's try and park here. 7.48. Let's get our time. I know I keep changing this all the time. We'll get our time going again. Just so we can get in here a bit quicker. So we need a full-time cleaner... Oh, do we need a full-time? We could probably get a full-time cleaner. Uh, come and talk to you. Can we pause? We can. So, feeling thorny, customer service. We want uh, one full-timer. I think we're going to have to go with a double. New campaign, uh, part-timer, customer service. Two. Uh, new campaign, we'll go... Feeling thorny, cleaning, uh, two part, no, two full time. I think that's what we really need. All right, let's come back out of here. Uh, do we need anything else for our store? Let's go Bisman. Now, cleaning this interior, our pricing is a little off by the looks of that. All right, let's drop that back to 20, 34. 37 and 42 will leave. Actually, we'll drop those down one. Uh, three, 
25. We'll see how that goes. Might be a little bit better. All right, so we'll go and open straight away if we can. Where are we just here? Right. Bang, let's go to the register. We'll go start working. We go to kind of view, actually Bismarck schedule. Eight till eight. So current security is poor, we know. Right, let's skip through and that they should come through tomorrow, hopefully those employees. Alright, done. Do we need I don't think we need anything else in here. Um, other than like this which is not what I wanted to do. Um, the security. I don't know how we're going with stock. I haven't even bothered to look. Actually, we probably should have got a delivery today, shouldn't we? We can organise it for tomorrow, so we'll have to go Bismarck. Uh, no, we're pretty good on all stocks, so that's good. Don't have to stress too much about that. Right, let's head back home and we'll go back to sleep. We've got to try and we get up at 7 a.m. That's enough time to run back down again. Okay, so let's go 7.04 will do. I think they'll send through 17.04. That's really low. Fresh food. We've got fresh food in the car, don't we? Really need to bring that back to the fridge. Where is our car? Just here. I need storage. We've got enough time to run that back, so let's grab that and run that back, cause just in case I forget again. But um, yeah, our next shop's going to be called Beast Burgers, but we're going to have burgers, hot dogs, fries, and ice cream and stuff like that. So I've got, as I said, I've got that fully um, set up, ready to go. The logos and everything. Um, we'll look at the Econa view as well when we get down here. Bang, let's go like this, start working, skip, economy view. Okay, so theft was 122 that time, so that's a little bit of theft, I suppose. It's probably our worst day yet. Um, rent, expensive flowers, soda cans are a bit low. Let's look at, um, pricing's better, 100%, that's good. All right, skip time. Oh, I probably should cancel there. Uh, we can open this. So what have we got? Uh, employees app. Okay, there we go. Candidates. So we've got cleaning. Full time is critical. Full time is critical. You're forty four percent though. So let's hire you. Uh, two full timers. Peaceful work environment is nice to have. You're a bit cheaper, but you want a clean work environment, which is important, but that's fine to the show their age at 27. Good old old Dick Arnold. Uh part-time, both critical. We'll go for the younger person, although 51's still pretty bloody old, isn't he? Um cleaning is fine. Let me go. Configure this, let's go. Feeling thorny. Done. I don't mind that shirt. Uh, we can go black jeans, we can go normal joggers. Don't think we need a cap, I don't think we need an apron. Same as this, don't think we need a cap. Black pants. Uh, normal joggers is fine. Yep, done. That'll work, so you can have that. Um, I think I need to unassign both of you. Unassign both of you. I want to get both of these guys um, uh, train. Okay, let's click, get rid of that. Okay, Dick, train, yes. Okay, Lord, yes. I think once we train Dick once, um, that'll be fine. We don't have to stress too much about that. Let's skip through the rest of this. Let's grab our cleaning. Our cleaning guy should be pretty good. Um, I just obviously need to assign him um, 
his work hours and that sort of stuff, so we'll do that as well. Right, go Bisman, uh, schedule, so he's the cleaner. This is going to be for every day. 56 hours a week, which is too much, so let's drop you back. 10 to 4, which is 42 hour a week, which is good. Uh, that should be good. I don't know how much it's going to cost us, though, but we'll see what happens. Right, how are we going for um, inventory? So what day do we actually open? Customers over time, that's the days. Do we have... Um, marketing, settings, no inventory and pricing. I thought we had... Um, The ability to see, it's only got the last five days, so I don't know exactly what day we open. I think it's probably like day three or something. Um, so it's been a little bit. Let's go Bisman. So inventory and pricing, cheap gifts, we've sold 108. Uh, that's Saturday, so we need to change this to Monday. 108, so I only need one box. Actually, that's cheap flowers. 60, so we need two boxes. Uh, expensive flowers were sold 50. We're going to need three of those. Cheap gifts 108 and 160 of you, so that's fine. Soda can were sold 52, so just one of each of those. I think it'll be fine, and that'll be Monday. But it looks like we've got do have plenty of stock in there, so we don't need to stress about that. Right, let's go home. These other guys are going to be training, um, as I said, so we don't have to worry about those guys. I just want to get them above 50%, um, and then we should be pretty good. So let's sleep tomorrow. We need to get up again at 7.30ish to work the day again. The 1,700-hour profit's going to drop a little bit now because... Um, we're paying a cleaner as well, so that's going to be another thing we need to keep an eye on. We should actually keep an eye on our theft. Forty dollars worth of theft. That's not too bad. Uh, all right, let's come back in here. Go like this, and we'll work. We'll skip the whole day. All right, they're both finished training. Let's go, my employees. So you're going to go back again. Dick is going to be assigned to feeling thorny. Uh, Bizman schedule. So Dick is our full timer. So you're going to work all day. Change that so we can take him off Saturday, Sundays. And that's 100% critical, which is good. Um, he's going to be heaps happy. So Saturday, Sunday, we need to put our other person on. What's that noise in the background? No idea. Kid, I talked with a good friend yesterday. Name is Gary. He owns a drive-in wholesale store down in the industrial area. They sell stuff in big chunks, but a lot cheaper. You should bring a car. It's too far to walk. All right, let's go for a quick drive down here. I know we've just got to drive in and out. We're already, I think we've already got them. We've already spoke to them because they're already doing the delivery, aren't they? Uh, is man, who's doing the? Yeah, just drive and spoke to these other guys to do the delivery, and they, I don't think I'd worry about them doing the delivery anyway. Uh, we'll need to um, head down and talk to the warehouses along the waterfront here. Because um, they're going to deliver to our warehouse eventually. We're going to have to get drivers and that's... I wish I had a horn. I don't have a horn. H and B don't do anything. B for beep, H for horn. Alright, let's just drive straight back out again. Don't need anything. All right, back Done the uniforms. Customer. You're always complaining, customer. There you go, kid. Right, now we need to do Continue our training. To customers and keep improving. Keep improving. And by the way, you know you don't. Alright. It's just shit. So let's scoot around this dude, but nope, couldn't do it. Right, we'll go to the Uh what time does it shut? The Manhattan Business School. Eight o'clock. There's no point in going there. Just so we could go there and get a little bit of training in, but we're not going to make it. It opens at 6, so we'll go there 6am tomorrow, because the next 
Uh, two days, Thursday, Friday, we've got our employees working for us, so we don't have to worry about working, which is good. Um, and then our other employee should train tomorrow and Friday, I hope, and then they should be at 50% so they can work better than what they would, obviously, if we... It's happy, that's good. I don't know why he's so happy. First employee, positive revenue, completed first goal. Yep, good. All right, sleep. So we want to sleep till, let's go, 5 a.m. All right, 15.22. So a little bit less. I don't know why I ate before I went to bed. I always do that. Shouldn't eat before I go to bed. Just defeats the purpose because then you wake up hungry anyway. So you might as well go to bed hungry. Doesn't really affect you. Um, in game, obviously. Don't recommend it in real life, but. Alright, we'll head up here. We'll get to the school by 6. We'll do our. Oh, I nearly went too far then. Get our training organised. Definitely want to look at. Um, getting some security. I think one security camera can cover our whole store, which is really all we need. Alright, so this should open at 6am. Uh, looking at Bismarck, schedule for today, everyone's working, which is good. Insights, everything was good yesterday. Um, 56 customers, we only had, what was day 7? Uh, yesterday, okay, that's over, so yesterday from 7. That sort of peaks it. Five o'clock, so maybe we should go ten till eight. Let's move that over. So let's change that for all days, and then we'll go untick that, get rid of that and that. So ten till eight, and then we'll test that out and see if that makes a bit of a difference. Um, still plenty of stuff in stock. Maybe expensive flowers are getting a little bit low, but that's not too bad. Obviously, long term, the whole goal is to set up a warehouse distribution um, setup so we don't actually have to um, organize to deliver anything. It just gets automatically delivered, which is really cool. So we should finish at the same time. Our business shuts. Done. Let's go employees. You're at 46%. Train one more time. Can have feeling thorny, that's good. Alright, we need to come out of here and head back home. And then we need to go to sleep. Hopefully we made some decent profit again today. We're, we're sort of just keeping our head above water. We're not making massive amounts. I know when I was playing the 0 0.5... Went too far, I did. Bloody hell. This is 2nd Street. No, 4th Street. Um, when I was playing the 0 0.5 version I was making five six thousand dollars a day from this gift shop so um, I did also put in smart watches because nobody had any smart watches in the area but um I think oh shit uh, people have smart watches at the moment really need to watch where I'm driving they're going to hit the trash on the side of the road all right done we need to get back up at five uh, let's go 527 that's fine much did we make? 15.39, so we're still making a decent amount of money. Um, eat some fresh food. Go and complete this course. Gonna have to fix this thing eventually. Let's look at our um, economy view. So 27 in rent. Theft is one, yeah, 147, that's crazy. I need to work out where is our... Um, Uh, not office supply, it is a furniture store, and it should be down in this new district down here. No, that's not a furniture store, it's an appliance store. Uh, where is it? Do, do, or is it? I can't see where it is now. Well, let me quickly look in here, let's go. Um, general, 
finance, no, building management, security and theft. Security cameras, a oh, AJ Peterson and Sons. Okay, so they're down here. Okay, so 0 0.5, they were in a new store. Which I believe, actually, if I look at um, the Voodoo maps, yeah, we don't have access to the new area yet. There's a new area that gets unlocked in 0 0.5. Um, which we don't have access to just yet, so it's probably the main reason why. Let's just sleep a couple of minutes. Enter the store. Go and do our last lot of training. Skip through and we'll head down straight down to AJ Peterson's and grab a security camera. Perfect, so that's done. Uh, we need to jump in our car. We need to come into here and go demand. So we need burger. Burgers We've got 10 businesses though. Um, right for burgers and hourly lawyer fee. We need a lawyer as well, really. You know, in business, we always research a market before we go into it, okay? Finally, before you start your next business, make sure you find a building with a high traffic index. Serving high demand products combined with an address seeing a lot of foot traffic means high revenue. 100%. That's why we got our gift store where it is, because it's got high foot traffic. Um, Alright, let's come into here. <clears throat> what store? Where's our security cameras and stuff? Speakers. Uh, where is our security? Yeah. Yep, security dome. There we go. Alright, sorry guys, I just had to clean my throat a little bit. Um, let's grab two of these guys. Uh, what else do you want? Industrial grill, which... Uh, and a hot dog grill. Can we afford all this? I hope we can. Industrial hot dog. 9,000. Alright, we'll come out of there. We might need to save up a little bit more. Okay, industrial and hot dog grill means I want to come in and grab an ice cream and we also want to grab industrial fryer uh, we need to grab um, cabinet we need two cabinets with drawers about to run out without paying then um, two cabinets with drawers we're gonna need stick that in there we're gonna need two more cabinets with drawers and two registers no, cabinets with drawers. Uh, where's our registers? Are there any cash registers here? Yeah, it's all bar stuff. We should have... Um, I can't see a cash register here anyway. Office phone, classic phone. What's that? It's shampoo. That's security stuff. Um... Can't see registers here anyway. Can we, we can't even afford a storage shelf, really. Um, oh, okay, so cabinets with drawers. Gonna need two shelves. We're gonna need two trash bins. Can we? Have we got trash bins? That's a hairdressing stock. That so should be here somewhere. Ottoman, uh, where the hell? I can't see where they are. I don't think they're even here. Alright, well. That done. We'll come out of here. Actually, I probably should park that and go manage. Security camera. We can run this straight over into here and see how this goes. Alright, so we are open, so if we place this smack bang in the middle... Right there, and then if we come back into Bishman, 100%, which is really good. Alright, um... Need to throw some more of this stuff in the boot. We need to look at, um... Obviously somewhere to rent, let's go... Retail. 
traffic of 30, 42, 30, 36, 30, 50, 30. This is close to the other one though, so I think this is going to be... Can't afford it. Uh, I was going to say this is with the one we go with. We can't pay off any debts. No, nope. okay, we're just going to have to wait. Um, I can run this over anyway and leave this. Uh, let's put this out the back. Right, we'll have to head home. It's just money we're short now. We're not making as much as we were um, in the 0 0.5 when I did my own little playthrough before starting the recording, so... Right, let's get some sleep. Uh, we'll sleep till midnight, or just after midnight. Get our employee on the go. Uh, let's go my employees, so you can go there. Feeling thorny, business schedule. So Saturday, you can work the whole day. Sunday, you can work the whole day. Now these guys should be all green, 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 and green. Perfect. What did we make? Uh, what's our overall? 2-2. Two, two. So we made a decent amount. Um, theft was still a little bit. We probably won't get it down to zero, I don't think, but we'll see what happens. Um, right, done. Let's look at our current um, stock. We need some expensive flowers. 91 over the last seven days, so we should be good for that today. Um... Uh, Google Maps, we're going to go set, not set destination. Uh, rent the building, start new business. We're going to go with fast food restaurant, Beast Burgers. Done, we'll go start business. Um, place the cabinet, grill, all that sort of stuff. Yep, okay, so let's do that while we can. Might as well do it now. Um, and I'm going to have to get two cash registers from the other place that we get things and stuff from. The appliance store, not AJ's, the appliance store. I don't know why AJ doesn't have registers, but anyway. Alright, let's park this bad boy out the front. We're going to have to come back in here and grab our trolley. So as far as staff goes, we can't get any staff now. We need to wait till next. Actually, these guys may work out. Uh, let's have a quick look. Let's go. You're cleaning. Actually, no candidates. You can go Beast Burgers. You're full time. Done. Uh, beast burgers, full time, nice to have a peaceful work environment, and you want part time critical, best burgers, that's f beast burgers, I should say. Uh, what's your clean 44? Let's train. Yeah, we need to unassign them. Uh, let's go train. Train, that's expensive to train that. Damn it. Alright, so we want to probably set up over here somewhere, so let's just place these there for now. Grab this out, we'll go out and grab the rest of our stuff and bring it in. We want to go, um, industrial fryer, ice cream counter, two cabinets with drawers. So if we go our industrial fryer, put it at the back wall there, we go with our ice cream counter. I don't know which way... Do we... I don't know if we're going to come around this side to use that. I'll have to look at that. We may, have to need, may, may need to turn that around. Uh, that can go there. That can go here. This one needs to go there. We'll bring in our grills and stuff. And our security camera. I don't know if the security camera is going to make much difference. Let's go that on there. Hot dog grill on there. Other cabinet with drawers on here. Security camera. 
Yeah, I think that there would be good. We will probably need another one. That's ice cream, that's fries, that's going to be... Oh. Burger. That's hot dogs. So we need storage at the back. Um, open Bizman is not to see requirements. Yep, so we need to go Bizman. Okay, so one burger grill. We need an extra burger grill, actually. That's interesting. I didn't think we are going to need an extra one. Let's park that there. So we're going to have to... Go and grab an extra burger grill. Uh, burger grill. Which means we're going to need an extra... Shelf as well. Uh, what time... Did that you open late, don't you? Yeah, like nine. You guys open at six. So if we wake up at five thirty, five forty, whatever, we'll head down there. We'll grab another burger grill. Uh, let's go Bishman Industrial Grill. Industrial Grill, and we need three. More counters just because I can then we're gonna need like storage and stuff as well at the back we're gonna need tables and chairs so I'm gonna have to um, look at that as well obviously we just don't have enough money right now so uh, Metro Wholesale I don't know why you want me to go Metro Wholesale it's not very good as far as money goes I mean cost goes Right, let's get this done. Um, but I don't want to cut too much out for you guys either, so... Right, let's just come in. Let's go. Where's the industrial group? 1400. How much are these? 470. Is that... An, we've just got enough for that. Okay, we can't afford to buy everything I want to buy, but... Have to wait till tomorrow. Alright, um... Yeah, we can't really do anything as far as um, our debt goes either. We can only get a maximum of 40k. I don't think there's another bank we can go to. We could probably go to another bank. Uh, Alright, place that there. Let's move this over. Let's grab this. Place that down. There. I think I'm going to have to turn this guy around. Uh, burger, let's go Bijman. So that's all good. Now we just need um, all the stock delivered. So we can actually organize this through um, the Bijman as well. So we can go into Beast Burgers. Uh, deliveries. Ooh, why don't we have a contract here? I think we have to go and do that manually maybe. May need to go down and see them about that, but I think like we're that short of money. The only real thing we can do now is actually let's go Bismarck back to here. Let's go yesterday. Yes, it was still pretty good there. I don't know if we should extend it a little bit till like ten o'clock and see how we go. Twelve till ten, maybe. I don't know, we'll have, have to have a look at that. I don't think I can add any more hours to our full-time employee, so... Uh, tomorrow we're going to have to go up there, we're going to have to come down here, that's at 8, and that one's at 9, so if we sleep till like 7.30... Full 24 hours. Another two six, that's pretty good. 